A 67-year-old man is dead following a house fire in Cherokee County. Medics rushed him along with his wife and another couple to the hospital Saturday night for smoke inhalation. Now, Christy Hutchings with the New Talk 1067 spoke with firefighters as they continue to work to determine what caused the deadly blaze. Monday afternoon, fire investigators were back out to the home where a 76-year-old man lost his life. Investigators say a couple was in town visiting another couple when the fire broke out. Everybody was out at the time that they got there. We did send ambulances to the scene to take care of those um, who needed help and to transfer those people to the hospital. Investigators say both couples suffered from smoke inhalation. There was also a five-year-old in the home who was not harmed in the blaze, which had already consumed 50% of the home by the time fire Firefighters could get there. We have fire investigators out there this afternoon that are looking for a cause of the fire. They haven't uh, informed me as of yet as to what the cause may have been. They have to interview the people that were there at the scene and ask questions to them uh, as to what may have caused the fire, uh, if they have any idea, if they had any type of, of appliance on or a heater on or whatever. Fire Public Information Officer Tim Cavender says this is the second fatal fire the county has had this year. And and any time there's a loss of life, it takes a toll on firefighters. For firefighters and the people that work these fires, you know, our main purpose is to protect property and to protect lives, most of all. And when something like this uh, happens, it's really difficult even on the firefighters because that's why they're out there is to help save lives. As of Monday evening, we don't know the conditions of the other three people. In Cherokee County, I'm Christy Hutchings with the new talk 1067 for Fox 5 News.